Hi guys, this is a quick tour of our first time back at Carowinds with the new entrance here that they have when you pull up. Um, this is going into the parking lot. You can see the Fury 325 right there. And when you get out of your car and you start walking in, the Fury is right there. It is like looming over the parking lot and every ride that comes by, the people are screaming and it's just an absolutely monstrous coaster that greets you right at the entrance of Carowinds. It's totally awesome and terrifying and unbelievable all at the same time. The new walkway they have built, the Fury of course plunges up under it and they have these glass panels where you can stand and watch the coaster go up under and come back out and the sound is is so loud and you can just feel the whole ground shake when this huge coaster like lunges up under you it's just so awesome this is the new entrance walkway up to the main gate of Carowinds and this just shows how much fury wraps around um, the front entrance it just goes from the hill and here comes one of the trains After you walk up the walkway, this is the main atrium. The tickets and guest services are over to your left right here. And then I'll swing around and show you the rest of the atrium. Now this is the main entrance now. So this is the gates that have replaced the other gates. And this just shows the rest of the circular entrance to Carowinds. When you go through, it looks very much like Disney World now, I think. Right behind this gentleman to the left, you can see they've taken out the fountain. They've also taken out that hill that you had to walk up and down at the very front of the park, which I'm glad they took that thing out. Now this shows walking up to the Fury. Um, it was a really crowded day during spring break when we went, so there was a bunch of people there. And the ride wait time, I think, was two hours and 30 minutes right now. But, um... This is what it looks like on the ground, and it was just really cool to see. This clip of video was shot on a different day, but I wanted to show you you can check your height and then also try out the seat and see how you feel in that seat. And what I love about the entrance of this coaster is you can see the people when right as they have just finished their ride and they're all like in shell shock over what they just experienced and it's so cool to see that right after they are finished with the ride and then you can see on the hill right behind them um, there another train will be going up right when one finishes and the line moves quickly because they have so many train rotations and it carries, I think, 38 people. I'm not positive about that, but when one train's going up the hill, the other one's finishing, and so the line moves pretty quickly.